here with uh, Jamie Ferullo. Just uh, won one up in 21 holes. You were two down on 17. Uh, what was going through your mind? What was the strategy there? Uh, I mean, I'm really, I'm really quite speechless at this point. It was 17 is a tough tee ball for me as a because I, I cut the ball and I hit a good one down the middle and hit a great hybrid to about 15 feet and you know just two put it up there and um, you know we came down to 18 and it was I had a bad lie over here um, so I just I said to myself put it in a position where you can at least make it or chip it in and I chipped it in and um, you know I, John played really well all day um, I think the only mistake he made all day was on 18 um, in that regulation round but um, I really just kept battling. I, I've done this, you know, before. Last year in the second round, I was five down on the back nine and came back and won. And um, I just kept fighting out there. I had my my father in the back of my head saying, you know, just just keep fighting. Uh, finally, what, what ended up putting you over? You guys were pretty neck and neck in those extra holes. Um, but you, you drive you drive the green on 18 um, on the way back on the 21st hole. Really put the pressure on Clancy. Um, was there th what, what were you going for it the whole way? Was there thoughts of laying it up and playing a little safer? Did you really want to put the pressure on? Yeah, uh, there was there was some thought, but it I have I hadn't been hitting a lot of unbelievable wedge shots today, so I just kind of I said might as well go for it. And worst thing that happens is I'm gonna hit it long. Um, but I started it at probably the tent and hit a big cut in there and just happened to be in good position and I just tried to get it down there. I was, I was really trying to make it, but it's not good when kind of the last thought is don't hit it way by. So I left it a little short, but left myself in a good position to, you know, to make that putt.